Hello and welcome back. This is Steam. This is a Superpower Saturday edition. What does that mean? It means we're doing a little bit of everything, a full body exploration of fitness fun. We're going to need bands around an anchor point and weights for today's workout. As you can tell, there's no music playing. What? Why is there no playing music playing, coach? It's so that you can pick your favorite tune. So I'll wait here while you set up your music. And you're back and you set up your music and here we go. I know, right? Wow, what a, what a great human pause. All right, so we're going to drop this party down onto some hands and knees. Foot's going to go out to the side. If you're playing this back on demand, you know the drill. I'm going to be talking to my friends, talking with my friends that are live with me online. I see them. They see me. We're one happy workout family. Inner thigh hip rolls. Okie dokie artichoke. Again, weights and bands for today's festival of exercise exploration, right? It's constantly an exploration. So we're exploring where our edges, how many reps we can do, the last one of those and changing size. We and we get to continually explore our edge because that's where growth is. That's how we stay moving forward. Yes, the workouts change. Yes, we bounce from format to format. Yes, ideally we want to build on what we've created in our shorter work to rest ratio cycles into our longer work to rest ratio cycle. So here we are in a medium, right, right dead in the center. 30 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. Good. Flipping over onto our side. Or sorry, onto our back. Onto the wipers. So a great opportunity for you to play with some weights that you would normally use on a power day. Seeing if maybe you could handle them for 30 seconds. With these work to rest ratios, we're not looking to just get to the end. Like, oh, I completed it. No, we're looking to like sprint through the end. Spread so hard with these extra movements that we find our edge maybe 10 seconds early and you got to catch your breath for five seconds and then come back and give me another rep. That's really ideal, honestly. The last one, feet open up, opposite knee to foot. Well, ideal is like feeling capacity, like right at 30 seconds, right? But sometimes that's not possible. And I'd rather it be the former, meaning you work so hard that you got to take a break early versus get to the end of the cycle and you haven't pushed it all the way to that edge. Good. Last one of those. We're going into a figure four loss. Right foot, switch it up, changing side. One, all right, dropping that. Here we go. Knee pulling it one knee at a time up and into the chest. Good. Knee all the way up. Let's see if I can twist it. Let's see if I can over. Let's keep it. Grab that bottom foot if you haven't already. And we're changing size once again. Knees out and over, step legs, twist. Grab a foot if you'd like it. We're going to drop that knees behind the head, alternating straight leg raises, one leg at a time coming up. Last one, friends, both feet coming flat onto the floor. We're looking for some hip thrusts, pushing into the skills, engaging the glute, breathing with the abdomen. One hips up, we're gonna kick one leg at a time. Good. Dropping it down. Once you grab a knee, once you flip this body over onto some hands and knees, flip the left wrist. 
them into a cat cow mode. I'm changing sides. And hands up, we're going for big hip circles all the way around. And change direction. And child's pose, that party heels together. These are wide walk into the fingertips. Hands on the right. Here's the left. And back to the midline. I will go for a bird dog. Leg long, arm long, extend. I will continue. And switch. Hands down, looking for planks. Downward dog rocks. All right. Beginning to move this party along. We got a few of these here, folks. Inhale to that plank. Exhale, push back downward dog. Engage the shoulders as we're pushing the chest back beneath the thigh. There's an internal rotation with the arm. Armpits squeeze towards the midline. Last one, alternating knee bends. One knee at a time, pedal. Looking for a deeper sensation into that. Here, pain and half region. Last one, feet together, let's put my hands, let's put this into a hip flexor, flip this out, and let's go. And switch. And switch. And switch. And triple twist. Good, and onto the back knee, hands onto the hip flexor. We're gonna lean into this thing. Going for a psoas stretch here. Oh yes, there's that time. Here we go. Little hand floss. Good. Last one. Changing the size. Same deal. Yeah, I'm just going right for the hand floss. Love that extension, y'all. Nice straight arm all the way out, making like a half circle as we extend it up, pulling the rib cage off the pelvis. Last one, we're stepping into a frog squat, hands on the floor, bouncing into the flex. Good, folks. Going to a ninja next. Both feet are wide. We're gonna bounce side to side. Big rotation of the foot. We are flat on one foot. The other foot points up towards the sky. Last one. When transfer right into a side lunge bounce and twist. Good. Feet flare, butt drops, sumo squat, shoulder circle. Last one. 
All righty, feet together, reverse tie lunge onto the ball of the toe. Step it back, big shoulder circle. Why, hello there. Get full alternating reverse lunges. Split squats coming at you. And switching sides. Last one. All right, swing squat. Man. Here we go. If you don't need to show this, all right, coming to the end of this party. I know. I know. Gonna begin hopping around a little bit. Arms up, elbows to knees. Here we go. Cardio wake up coming up next. Superpower Saturday, four circuits, five exercises, three times through. Dancers, working for 30 seconds, switching for 10. We are starting off with a banded circuit first. Feet together, step it. And an imaginary jump rope. Here we go, onto your toes. Little shuffle. One foot. And the other. On the boat. Into a scissor. Back into a sumo stance. Butt's going to drop. Hands going to the thighs. We're going to pulse into these lateral glutes. Engaging them. Arms are out. We're going into a little doorknob. Anterior posterior rotation. Into a little flat backwards. A little bit lower, friends. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Good scarecrow. Elbows are staying in line. Okay, maybe your relaxation doesn't look like that, but I want your elbows to look like that. Last one, bent over flies. Last one, y'all. And rest. Grab yourself a quick sip of water. We're moving right along once again. Bands around anchor points, okay? First circuit, we are starting off with some reverse lunge forward raises, as we are. Out of those reverse lunge forward raises, we're going into a lat pull down. Then into an abdominal extension floor. Spin, we'll twist, we'll ab extend. We're going to a sumo hoop, bicep curl. Then onto the other side for an abdominal extension. Five exercises, three times three. Working for 30 seconds. Switching for 10, beginning with those reverse lunge forward raises. In 15 seconds, light bands. For five, four, three, two. Here we go. All righty, exercise number one, the reverse lunge forward raise. Drop it down, engage with these anterior deltoids. This is a levator move. You can bring the hands up over the head. And this is a position your neck may want to get involved. Or you say, no thanks to the neck. We appreciate your effort, neck, but not today. Not today. Last one, here we go. 
into a heavy band. We have some lat pull downs coming at us. Exercise number two. And three, and two, and one. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, all the bands going into your hands. Feet are going to flare. You're going to hold those bands in your hands, flex in a drop, and send it out, out and in. Abdominal extension, uh huh. Fighting the rotation of the body using the oblique that's closest to our anchor point. For me, that's my right side, so I'm turning in my right obliques. Uh, the longer we sit the arms out there, the harder the move is. You're welcome. For five, four, three, two, one. Excellent. All right, here we go. Sumo bicep curls coming at us next. And two, and one. Once again, maybe a medium, maybe a heavy band. Who knows? Feet flare butt drops. Arms are out. Arms are on that shelf. Bring it up and in. Five, four, three, two, the last rep. Excellente. All right, abdominal extension at the end of round number one. One to this left side in two and one. Five, four, three, two, one. Already reverse lunge, forward raise in three, and two, and one. Five, four, three, two. Last rep. Lap pull downs. Come in at you. And two. And one. Round two. One. Help. All righty. I've done all extension. Four. Three. Two. Four, three, two. Last one, y'all. Two by curl, round two. Keep playing, but dropping arms out in, in two and one. Let's go.
Five, four, three, two, one. All right. Abdominal extension, the end of round two. Rock and roll, friends. I know, I know. Too easy, right? Too easy. Well, let's push it here in two and one. Challenge yourself. We have one more round of this circuit coming in. Nice, good. Full extension. Come on. Challenge it. Challenge it all the way. Straighten those arms. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh, yeah. Hold it a little bit longer. Get it out there. Stick it. Bring it in. 10 seconds. And rest. All right, last round. Reverse lunge forward race. Here we go. Okay, five. And rest. Lat pull downs. Here we go. Last time in two and one. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Okay, have dominant extension. Four, three, one, two. Go, 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 go. Last time on this oblique, challenge yourself. Three, two, one. Love it. Smoke her Three, two, one. Love it. Last time, abdominal extension, the end of round number one of the circuit. Friends, new circuit coming up next. Here we go. But before that, last time, abdominal extension. Next circuit, though. Oh, I tell you, love superpower Saturday. It's just like, let us get through it. No, we can't. Okay, great. Next circuit, we're starting off with a heavyweight single overhead dumbbell swing gonna be a party then we're gonna hey we're gonna keep that same heavy leg for a single arm overhead reverse lunge we're gonna be on one foot stepping back dropping a knee then driving up a step forward two one and resto very nice quick time on the water then out of that we're gonna be into a medium weight for a plank twist then up the stand back to our heavy weight for the overhead reverse lunge back into that medium weight for the plank twist that's five exercises we'll go through it Times through. I know what a party. We are done with bands. So you're done with the little corner. I know. I know. Thank you. Thank you for putting up with that. Here we go. In 25 seconds, overhead dumbbell swings. Single heavy, single medium light. In five. In four, in three, in two, and one. The overhead 
dumbbell swing. So we're holding to the edge, we're swinging that way up, up and over our head. The big drive through the here, folks. Four. One. Love it. Okay. Same heavy weight. Grab it in your right hand. Hello, right hand. Weight's going to go up and over your head. Feet together. Overhead. Reverse lunge. Single leg. All right. So just the right leg goes back. You drive the knee. You step it back. You drive the knee. It's a party. Extra credit points. If you can get that leg back. But put it on the ground. All right. Look at that. Gold star. Gold star for us. And we're just on one leg. Okay. So instead of alternating legs, one foot is forward, one foot's going back. You'll drop the knee, drive it up. Yeah, perfect. Because we'll go to the other arm and do the same thing on the other side. I know. Party. We like to have fun here at Steam, don't we? Last rep, weight's going to drop. Medium light weight coming up. Okay, same weight that had the arm. Same arm that had the weight. That's the word. Plank twisting, okay? So that was right arm. So left hand along the floor, right hand's holding the weight. We're going to plank, we're going to twist. My. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Wait it up. Here we go. Overhead. Single one. Overhead. Reverse one. In two and one. Four, three, two, last one. Weight's gonna drop. Plank twisting, other arm. Here we go. Exercise number five. Weight's in that left hand, hands down. And that's our circuit, friends. Okay, let's do that too, my friends. Good, big rotation, full thing. So we're from the toes onto the side of the foot. If I want you to look like almost like you're in a side plank with both feet on the ground. As we rotate to the side. So you're going to feel like both shoulders stack. We pull into that lat of the right arm. Five seconds. And rest. Overhead. Reverse lunge. Huh, lies. Overhead dumbbell swing. Excuse me. In three. In two. And one. Two, one. Arm is up. Feet together. Here we go. Overhead. Single leg. Reverse lunge. In two and one. Three, two, one, and back. Plank twist. Here we go. Three, two, and one. Let's get. Ten seconds. 
Four, three, two, one. Okay, plank twist, left arm. Great job, y'all. I'm making this look easy. <laughs> and the idea is close. Two and one. Here we go. The end of round two. Big rotation with that torso. Four, three, two, one. All right, last round of this one. And three, and two, and one. And here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. I got it. Last time, overhead, reverse one, and three, and two, and one. Great, y'all. Gold stars for everyone. Ten seconds. Last round. Interest. Four. Three. Two. There we go. Five, four, three, two, last one. Eight, stretch. We have reverse lunge. And two, and one. Three, two, one. Oh, my goodness. Three, two, one. Let's go. How are you doing, friends? We are done with this mini circuit. Or no, this is a full circuit. We're done with this circuit. We have another one coming up next. Yay! We need some medium or heavy weights for some sumo curl and press them. I let some curl, pinch and press. We're going to some overhead squats. Then it's some spurner hops into a mamba. Everyone's favorite, I don't know. And wrapping up that circle with a spurner hop. How fun. Last rep here in this plank twist. This is just great. And rest. You almost forgot that you're plank twisting, right? You were like thinking about the next circuit. I did that on purpose. All right, quick towel and water. We're coming into some medium weights for some sumo curl, pinch and pressing.
In 20 seconds, medium weights are up. Five, four, three, two, one. Sumo curl, pinch and press. I know we're flying here. Circuit number three. Looking great. Long with that spine as we come down. Keeping that chest up for three, two, one. I'm going to put the weights down just for a second. The feet don't go anywhere. You're going to stay right there. Maybe those same weights, maybe a little lighter. You know, I challenge yourself. Here we go. Overhead squats in three, in two, and one. Three, two, one. And dropping that already. Sprinter hopping coming out. Left it down, right foot back. Right hand hits the floor. You take the mark like an Olympic sprinter. And every time you find your own pace here, but I want you to think about exploding through that left leg versus like giving me so many reps that you feel like, wow, I want you to feel like you're giving me so much energy that your body's like, oh my gosh, I can't do it anymore. You know what I mean? Take it back to the mark, go explode, really get that foot off the ground. All right, I want to see space between your toes and the floor, friends. I know. Last rep. Okay, mambas. Hands down. Here we push it back. Like a little crouch move, a step up move, a kick through move, a wait for our friends move, all the fun stuff. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. Marvelous. Here we go. Sprinter hop, other foot, right foot forward, left foot back. Three, two, and one. Four, three, two, and one. All right, one round down. Back to medium weight, sumo curl, pinch and press in five, in four, in three, in two. And here we go. Round number two. All right, friends, you got two more rounds here. Three, two, one. All right. How did that? Oh, overhead squats. Oh, that's right. Here we go. Peter Flair, arms are up. Ugh. You know, my brain sometimes likes to skip the hard exercise. You know, I know y'all would appreciate it, but that's what we're here for, right? The challenge. You drop into it, friends, along with those arms. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. The real like, journey here with this exercise, being able to do a levator move, meaning weights over the head, have the neck relaxed, but the shoulders, anterior and posterior engaged. Good, weights are dropping, burner hops are coming. Okay, I wanna see more of that explosive step here, or hop, supposed to hop in two and one.
10 seconds. Last rep, y'all. And rest that one. Mamba. Round two. What the heck? Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, that was fun. Here we go. We're gonna happen. Right foot, two, and one. Friends, we got one more round. Three, two, last rep. All righty, sumo, curl, one press, and five, and four, and three, and two. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, overhead squats. Coming back in. In three, in two. And here we go. Neck is released. Shoulders are working. Press. <clears throat> Five, four, three, two. One, no rest. Runner hops last time. And two, and one. Last time on the right foot, that's what I mean. I mean left foot. Excuse me. And rest the rights. Mumbles come for you. And two. And one. And here we go. I can roll y'all. Home stretch. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. Spin our house. Put it forward, lift it back. Two, and one. Four, three, two, one. And rest. Hey, three circuits down. One to go, friends. 
last circuit for exercises. Okay, it's gonna look a little like this. We have some glamour hammers coming at you. We're gonna need some medium lights for that. We're gonna set up into a sumo side bicep press into a forward lunge cross curl, wrapping up that circuit with a super burpee. I know, how much fun. Getting it going in 25 seconds, final circuit of our workout. Okay, here's the time. Sorry not for the glamour hammer. Take some medium light and some medium heavies, mediums. Should be all we need. All right, here we go. And three, and two, and one. You hammer curl, you are glamour curl. I know. Very fun. Very fun. Looking great. Feel the rotation of the shoulders to get into that. Glamour curl position. Really also want you to feel like your shoulder blades are pinching together as those arms come up. Five, four, three, two. Last one. Already feet flare, butt drops, arms to the side, sumo, side press. And three, and two, and one. Like 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and rest. Okay, forward, cross, lunge, and curl. Some medium, medium, heavy, who knows? Feet are starting together. Give yourself a place to step into here. All right, you cross the center line, you drop down, you squeeze the center thighs, you crank a bicep curl, step back, change legs. The idea with this forward cross lunge and curl, that we're crossing the midline, not changing the direction that our feet point. So our point are always pointing the same direction. They're pointing when we're stepping back as when we're stepping forward. But we are crossing the midline, squeezing the inner thighs, and cranking that bicep curl. Weights are going down. Super burpee. I know, it's been a while since you super burpee. So what does that even mean, coach? Hands are going down. We're gonna give you a push up. You're gonna hop forward into a low squat. Uh, low frog squat, hands to the chest. Give me a low squat jump and down, hop back and push up. And you just keep repeating that. That's even thing of positive. Have fun. The end of round number one. We got two more rounds after this. Five, four, three, two, one. Lemmer hand around two. Two. And one. Last one. Feet flare, but drop. One, you're out. Hey, here we go. Sumo side press. Four, three, two, last one. Love it. Okay, forward cross lunge and curl it. Two, and one, and here we go.
five, four, three, two, one. Great strap. Super burpees. And two. And one. Friends, we got one more round. Three, two, rest. Already last time, Glamour Hammer's coming in. One more round. You've been saving something. But if you have, here's the time. Let's use it, right? Oh, good, good. I'd like to hear that. I'd like to hear that. Good, shoulder width pinching on that glamour curl. Yes, dual purpose for the biceps, but also for the plus. 10 seconds. Last rep. Keep flare. Some side press at the time. Two and one. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, done with that. Here we go. Forward cross lunge and curl on three, and two, and one. Last time. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Here we go. Super burpee. Last time. Hands down, last exercise, two and one. Let's get it. Ten seconds, y'all. Ten rests. That is it. Hey, that was so sick. Well, who knows? Whatever you need to begin to warm this thing down, because that's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to warm this party down. All righty. Onto our stomach. You're starting this off with a super Y. Hey, you did it. You made it to the end of another superpower Saturday workout. For us, that is the end of our work week together. But maybe this is just the beginning for you, or maybe you're playing this on Steam On Demand. You're like, where do I go to next, coach? Well, the great thing about our ongoing class banner is that you can follow to the left or right of this video and essentially work your muscle systems out of order, meaning you'll have rest in between your muscle systems. Get arms into a T and scorpion taps. What are we looking? 
pretty much do a steam workout every day <laughs> for 177 days. <laughs> That's how many videos we're at right now. Uh, for 177 days, we work a different muscle system every workout. What? That is just marvelous. Then I'm flipping over onto your back. But what does that mean? That means you have enough time to recover before we do all this crazy stuff again. I know. Recovery is so important. That's our recycle muscle systems here. Hands with the head, heels and together. Rotate. So we cycle the muscle system to give you a little bit of break so you can push it and you can get a little bit of muscle growth, increase some strength from workout to workout. Good. If you're opening up, opposite knee to foot here. That's enough for me. Not really, it's never enough for me. Last one, we're going into a figure four floss. Alternating those legs, pull it up and in, drop it and switch it. Hey. Oh, last one of those are coming to a full happy baby move next. If the next workout in your cycle is a rest workout, like it is for me, I definitely recommend something stretchy, something light. I'm going to do a yoga workout tomorrow. Get cool enough out of that. Maybe that means a walk for you in a light stretch. Maybe you just want to sign in and do one of our warm ups. You know, this is all, all of these things are possible. Put on these boots, we're doing one foot at a time, pull up hamstring. Both feet together, same deal. Sit on rub. One more. And then we're giving ourselves a round of applause because that is it for us today, my friends. We will see you on the next one.